Welcome to the Sphere of Grace. I am Pastor Shagun Baji. Thank you for viewing the Sphere of Grace. I believe it has been a tremendous blessing to you. I would want to hear from you, send in your prayer request, send in your testimonies and questions to the address on the screen. God bless you. The word for the day. God answers prayers. Hallelujah. God answers prayers. We serve a God who answers prayers because he is alive. He answers when we call. The Bible tells us in Jeremiah chapter 33 and verse 3, it says, Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and I will show thee great and mighty things which thou knowest not. God answers prayers. He didn't say, Call unto me, and I may answer thee. He says, I will answer thee, and I will show you great and mighty things which thou knowest not. This is awesome. It is God's will to answer prayers. He is willing to answer us when we call unto him. In Matthew chapter 7 and verse 7, he says, Ask and it shall be given unto you. He says, Seek and you shall find. He says, Knock and the door shall be opened unto you. You see, the word shall there is a strong word that shows certainty and the willingness of God to answer prayers. God answers prayers. He says, by terrible things in righteousness, will thou answer us, O God of our salvation. He answers us by awesome things in righteousness, things that will beat man's imagination. God answers prayers. In Psalm 65 and verse 2, the word of the Lord tells us, he says, O thou that hearest prayers, unto thee shall all flesh come. God hears prayers. When we call, he will respond to us. Amen. God has given us a free and gracious invitation to come before him in prayers. He says to come to his presence in prayers. Hebrews chapter 4 and verse 16, he says, Let us therefore come boldly to the throne of grace, that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help in time of need. There's an open and a gracious invitation to everyone to come to God in the name of of the Lord Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, you have access, direct access to the Father, and you can have all your prayers answered in that glorious name. Glory to God. Jesus gave us this promise in John chapter 16 and verse 23. He said in that day, speaking of this dispensation, he says, you shall ask me nothing, but whatsoever you shall ask the Father in my name, he will give it unto you. This is beautiful. This is a beautiful, beautiful uh, blank check that God has given us. You can fill in the gap. Whatever it is you require, you can go to the Father in the name of the Lord Jesus and He will not turn you down. Glory to God. Because God is faithful and God answers prayers. He still does. He still does. And He will forever answer prayers because he is true to his nature and is true to his word. Glory to God. If you will call on him today, he will respond. Is somebody calling out there? Call on his name, he will respond. Whosoever calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Salvation is prosperity. Salvation is safety. Salvation is deliverance. Salvation is upliftment. Whatever it is you require, as you call upon the name of the Lord, in the name of Jesus, he will respond to you because God answers prayers. I don't know what you've heard, or maybe somebody told you a lie that God does not answer prayers. Listen, beloved, let God alone be true and all men be liars. God still answers prayers. He has never stopped answering prayers. He still answers prayers. He answered prayers then, he's answering prayers now, and he will forever answer prayers. Call on him today, and he will respond to you in Jesus' name, amen. I believe you've been blessed today. Until I come your way again tomorrow, keep living and basking in the sphere of grace. I love you and God bless you. God is showing us how he does things. We must believe in our heart that God has answered us according to his word in prayer when we pray. And then we will see the physical manifestation of what we have prayed about. Today.